Hi everybody, welcome to my next RPG Maker XP Event Command tutorial. This time, I'll be showing you Exit Event Processing and Erase Event. Now, what Exit Event Processing will do is it will basically stop the processing of your event commands. So it's like adding a disallow in your show choices. So let's say Bob will go show choices. Choice one will be good. Choice two will be bad. And choice three will be none of your business. So choice three is going to be our disallow. But if we want bad to also be disallowed, we'll put in exit event processing. Now what that will do is it won't allow it to go past the end of the branch. So if we have him saying that's good to hear after the branch so text is down here I'll show you what that looks like talk to him he says how are you good bad none of your business none of your business is uh, the cancel but it not exiting the event process so I'll need to add that there too so I'll show you this again so none of your business so it automatically goes away same thing with bad He's, he'll say that's good to Sorry about all the noise in the microphone. It's pretty cheap. So, that's what exit event processing will do. Now, let's say when you say that's none of your business, you want him not to talk to you anymore. So, or you want him to disappear. You say none of your business. Instead of exit event processing, you put in erase event. That will temporarily make this event disappear until you leave and come back to this map. So, that's what we'll do. Talk to him. How are you? Say good. So that's good to hear. How are you? Bad. He stops talking to you. How are you? None of your business. Oh, I forgot one thing. The exit event processing. Because you still don't want it to go past. That's good to hear. You don't want it to go past the branch in. So you want him to disappear and you don't want him to talk to you. of your business. He disappears. So there you go. Um, I'm sure you can find other ways to use erase event and uh, exit event processing, but that's the basics of how to do it. Hope this helped. I'll see you in my next tutorial.